Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So Microsoft finds himself once again in an interesting situation where they are unable to resolve a known issue, which has been affecting Windows 10 and Windows 11 since January of this year, 2023. Now, I did post on this back in January, but just to do a quick update for the purpose of today's video and if you do still find yourself being affected by this problem. Now, Microsoft did confirm that um, the start menu, Windows Search and Universal Windows Platform UWP apps might not work as expected or might have issues opening. And um, Microsoft did say though back in January that um, it wasn't a Windows update issue. So the problems weren't caused by Windows updates. Um, but they did say that affected Windows devices might have damaged registry keys or data which might affect apps using Microsoft Office APIs to integrate with Windows, Microsoft Office or Microsoft Outlook or Outlook Calendar. And Microsoft gave an example of an app affected by this issue which was ClickShare. Now I'll leave a link down below to that video because it will provide you with a whole lot more information if you do find yourself affected. But as mentioned at the beginning of this video, um, if we head over to the Known Issues Health Dashboard page, this known issue um, at the top, um, mentioned here at the top, uh, has not been resolved and was originally opened on the 24th of January. I actually posted that previous video on the 25th and was last updated on the 18th of May 2023, which was yesterday in my region. So Microsoft as yet still not been able to resolve this issue uh, in Windows 10 and Windows 11. And they still say they are working on a resolution and will provide an update in an upcoming release. And um, with that, they also still give the um, original workaround to try and uh, temporarily um, resolve this issue, which is, Microsoft says, to mitigate this issue, you can uninstall apps which integrate with Windows, Microsoft Office, Microsoft Outlook or Outlook Calendar. And I did actually mention this workaround in that previous video. So as an example, um, um, one of those apps, as mentioned, would be um, an app like ClickShare, which this workaround may not be the best solution or temporary workaround because if you are relying on a certain app, then maybe you don't want to uninstall that app. But nonetheless, um, if the negatives, as I always say, are outweighing the positives and um, you know your start menu, Windows search and apps um, are not opening properly or are crashing or whatever the case may be, then you may have to uninstall one of those apps, which um, is integrated with Windows, Office, Outlook or Outlook Calendar. But just keeping you posted, because this is still a known issue, which has now been going on for a couple of months. And if you are affected, just to keep you updated and in the loop. And obviously, I'll keep my eye on this one. And if um, Microsoft does give us more info or a permanent official fix does roll out, I will obviously post and let you guys know. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.